Hello, good morning friends. So today we are going to discuss about the sole of the foot. Let us see the prosection of the sole of the foot. Here you can see the incision on the sole of the foot from its midline, vertical incision. After reflecting the skin, here we can see the superficial fascia which having a fatty layer. After removing the superficial fascia, in a layer wise, we can see the deep fascia, in which here we can see the plantar aponeurosis. Now you can see it is triangular in shape and here you can see its attachment and after removing the plantar aponeurosis, we can see the first layer of the sole of the foot. So in first layer, there are three muscles, most medial muscle is adductor hyalosis muscle here the next muscle which having a four tendon which is a flexor digitorum brevis muscle you can see their four tendons four lateral four toes and the lateral most muscle here you can see the lateral most muscle it is a abductor dgt minimi so this is the first layer after removing the first layer we can see the second layer of the sole of the foot in which here there are four muscle is present two tendon and two muscle one is the tendon of flexure hyalosus longus this one is the tendon of flexure digitorum longus in this tendon you can see the origin of the lumbricus muscle four lateral four toes here we can see the origin of four lumbricus and insertion of this muscle, this is the flexor digitorum accessorius. So, flexor digitorum accessorius inserted on it, and here you can see these are the lumbricus muscle, which are originated from this muscle. So, this is the flexor digitorum longus. In the third layer, we can see the deep muscle. This one is the flexor. Hyalosus brevis and this one is the adductor hyalosus, the oblique head here, the transverse head. Then the later most muscle is the flexure DGT minimi brevis. So after reflecting that muscle, here we can see medial plantar now, and after reflecting tendon of flexure digitorum longus here we can see the lateral plantar now so this is the lateral plantar now along with the lateral plantar artery and here the deep muscle now the muscle of the fourth layer here we can see the plantar introsci Okay, just deep to it, we can see the tendon of peroneus longus, which is inserted here and deep to it. Here we can see the insertion of tibialis posterior, which is inserted on the all the tarsals except talus. The main insertion is on the tuberosity of navicular. Thank you.